so you know how you go to the store and you're looking for something specific and then you see other things that are like really cheap and you really want them and so you get them and then you still can't find the thing that you've been looking for so you end up going home with all the other stuff you bought without having what you were looking for in the first place. That's what happened here. I don't know if I just like shopping or spending money or I, I just really wanted to get this stuff. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started. This is going to be a Target slash Books Million haul. So I went to Target first and the first thing I saw there um, was their little stocking stuffer, um, I guess like section or whatever. And I found these amazing purple headphones and I've been wanting headphones forever and these were five dollars and then I found a portable speaker and I've been needing a portable speaker for a while and this was five dollars as well so aren't these great stocking stuffers like the five dollars for each like this that's pretty nice like if I do say so myself um yeah so I found that and then I got a book because um, Target sells books cheaper than Books A Million, especially when they're hardcover. And I got Illuminae by Amy Kaufman. First of all, 20% off sticker on like all the books. Target has some really good books this right now and I only got one. Um, this is $18.99, um, it was sold for about $14, and let me see, um, the receipt. Where is the receipt? Okay, so I got this for $15.19. Yeah, I got this for $15.19, which is amazing, because this thing usually sells for over $20 at Books A Million. And you know what's so great about this amazing cover is when it comes off. And it has all these amazing, there's the title, has all these amazing script, like, I freaking love this book. This is the kind of book that I would just take home. It has like black pages and white pages and it just looks really awesome and I don't even know what it's about but I've heard so many good things about this book and this is like see-through kind of and it's just really pretty and that's kind of why I bought it but also because I have heard that it's really interesting so um, at some point I will read it and then I'll probably do a review on it or something depending on how I like it or not so yeah I'm really excited but um yeah I don't know too much about this and I don't want to say anything because it would be wrong most likely um but it does have blurbs by Lainey Taylor which of course Daughter of and Bone just finished that trilogy amazing trilogy planning on doing a review very soon um yeah it's got stuff from Scott Westerfield Beth Ravis who wrote Across the Universe, Veronica Rossi, who wrote Under the Never Sky, and Marie Lu, who's on the front here, who wrote, you know, the Legend and Trilogy, and yeah, really excited for this, so I got that. And then, I, I've been wanting to see this movie for so long. Um, it was for 20 bucks, which, yeah, it's still pretty bad to spend that much. But um, it's Inside Out, and I've heard it's a really good movie, and I don't want to rent it because my mom will let me rent stuff on On Demand right now, because we've already rented a lot of movies, so I just decided, you know, why not get it so that I could just have it, because I think it's actually going to be a really good movie. So, I'm really excited, because, yep. Alright, moving on to Books A Million. First thing I'm going to show you is what I got for school, and that is Baron Simply Shakespeare, original Shakespeare text, with the modern line-for-line -line translation of Macbeth. I have the one for Hamlet, and that's what I read. I showed that in my, uh, it was the November 
wrap up December TBR and Slate Haul. That. I showed that. And yeah, this was like eight bucks. No, it was $9.99, which isn't bad considering it's like, it's, it's, yeah. <laughs> and, um, yeah, this, um, the one for Hamlet really helped me understand it more, especially that now that I'm going to be in the play Hamlet, um, so I might talk about that in another video. Um, I, I have a plan sort of, of a video coming up. Um, but anyway, yeah, I just thought this was really awesome. Um, the Hamlet one helped me out a lot. So I thought, you know, the Macbeth one could help me out too. So yeah, really excited to read that. Of course, we're not reading it until after the Christmas break. I'm pretty sure. So I'll just have to wait. That almost fell over. Um, okay, so moving on, I got this really cute, um, this is lip balm. Um, I have really chapped lips. Like right now my lips bleed almost every, actually they do bleed every single morning and night um, because I have like a split down here that loves to show up during the winter time. So I got this really cute um, lip balm. It's, it's in the shape of a turtle and uh, it's v just the flavor, I guess you could call it vanilla. Um, and it was $3.99 and it was cheaper than the other ones. And yeah, that's just, that's it. It's a little belly opens up and it was just really cute. Thought it was adorable. So I am going to be using that and it looks like it gets a lot of product in it because the product is in the shell. So really excited to start using that so I can take better care of my lip. Moving on, I have a blind box and two blind bags from Books Million. Those are starting to get like really popular like in a lot of stores and I'm really excited because I actually have been starting, uh, uh, I started watching some unboxing videos on YouTube and that's where I just fell in love with them. So um, right now I have uh, these three. Oh my gosh, come back. Okay, so I have an Elsa, a Pooh Bear, I have an Anna somewhere, but it broke off my book bag because I used to have it on here, but I have the Evil Queen, which is so cute from Snow White. Um, I also have my Jack Skellington, which used to be on my keys, but then his leg has started to break, so I don't want to keep him on my keychain because I'm afraid his leg would break off. Um, I've also got like little blind box frenzies from Tokidoki. Uh, I got the Disney villains versus heroes thing. Ursula, I only got one of those though because that, that one was expensive. But I got this Disney villains keychain and this was an awesome Maleficent. So I got another Disney villains because these figures are actually really cool. They're like my, I, I actually like the villain figures more than, you've got to be kidding me. Guys, it's the same exact one. Oh, that's so disappointing because these things are not cheap. They're like $5.99 a bag. Wow. Well, I was really kind of hoping for like a Queen of Hearts or something and then that just happened. So, okay, well, we're just gonna move on right along. Um, I've got, so yeah, that was a Disney villain one. Um, this is the Series 3 Disney uh, key rings. Uh, uh, I think this is like Season 2 or Season 1, I don't remember. Um, but this one has some really cool characters including Alice in Wonderland and Peter Pan. So. Oh, this is metallic. Oh my gosh, this is an exclusive one. You guys, you guys, it is a gold Tinkerbell. That just made, that just made the blind bag so much better. Like, it's a freaking gold Tinkerbell. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. And that's an exclusive one. 
I was kind of hoping for a Nemo, but I got a gold Tinkerbell, so I'm okay. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna be buying more of those. That, that's really awesome. Okay, um, and then the final one that I'm gonna open is the Nightmare Before Christmas, uh, vinyl figurine line box. Um, I've only had one so far, and it was this really cool clown. Uh, I'm really hoping I don't get the same one, because... That would be really upsetting because this one is like $7.99. Yeah, it's $7.99. I do not want to get the same one. Okay, why can't I? Okay, so after bending the box a little bit, I finally got it off. Okay, let's see what it is. Okay, so it comes in like this sort of, looks like a trash bag. Oh good, it doesn't, wait wait guys i think i know what this is i think i know what this is let's just open it so you know oh wow i did not know what this is okay um oh this is cool it's um it's one of the ugh, i don't think i don't think they had a name for him but it's this one right here um, these are all the figurines you can get. So, I have yet to get, uh, yeah, I mean, this one's kind of cool. Um, it's not my favorite, I'm gonna be honest. Um, I, I actually like this one more than this one, but, you know, it's, 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 a uh, it's a progress thing. So, yeah, guys, um, that was my haul. I can't believe I got the same freaking Maleficent dragons. That's really upsetting. But I did get a gold Tinkerbell, so whatever. Um, yeah, guys, that was my haul. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm going to go watch Inside Out now. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.